Because of the air. The Now People program endeavors to encourage and inspire minority students by providing positive images of community people who have achieved success in their chosen fields. This face-to-face -face communication with people who have succeeded is the best way of showing opportunities exist. Three schools are currently participating in the project. At the Manhattan Place School, industry representatives from such companies as IBM, Hughes Aircraft, North American Rockwell, the phone company, and McDonnell Douglas met with the children in their classrooms and demonstrated some of the projects in which they were involved. Aerospace physicist Timothy Henderson and aerospace behavioral psychologist and engineer Herbert Swanigan discussed the McDonnell Douglas Skylab project with the students. The reason we have to put this on is because there's no air about us. One reason was to breathe, but now that there's also no air, we also have to use a radio. Why is it necessary to use a radio? Because without air, we can't hear, in addition to not being able to breathe. In order to hear, you have to have air, because as I talk, I cause the air to vibrate between my mouth and your eardrum. As the air vibrates, it causes your eardrum to vibrate, and you experience what we call hearing. At least your head tells you you're hearing. The Now People program is designed to show the boys and girls how important it is that they learn their lessons every day in order that they can become the engineers, the businessmen, the teachers of tomorrow. Stan Chambers, Action News, Manhattan Place School. This is food. Oh, let's take a look at what it says. It says instant rice. It says add 75 milliliters of boiling water, stirred, wait five minutes. Why are the five in the laboratory? Why yes, do they have there? Well, there's two zippers as an issue. No, he doesn't believe it. you got to disbelieve it. Well, it is, right? And the reason it is, is we're here on Earth, and above us, there's air stacked up for many miles, okay? And this air has weight, and it's pressing down, and it's keeping our bodies in, and our bodies are pressing out at the same time. It's like, if we remove this air, our bodies will swell, and many things will happen our blood, to our blood vessels and things like this. Do they have to wear this all the time in space? Look at a few things here. Put this on. How much does it weigh? Now look at the glove. You'll notice something about this glove? Any air out there is the first question. No. no. And if we don't have air, we cannot maintain life but for two reasons. First of all, we can't, we can't breathe. We can't breathe. And the second thing is we have to have air pressing on our body. Anybody, do you believe air is pressing on you now? That's the question. No. No, you don't have to wear all the time the spaceship. What would you wear? Oh. Just normal clothes. Just normal shirt sleeve is the word, isn't it? That's correct. That's shirt right. sleeve environment, we we'll call it. Um, a giant, um, a re a re entry. Uh, do you wear the suit or do you just um, uh, stay inside of the sky lamp or what you playing in suit? He wants to know when you are. Coming back, re-entering, do you wear the space suit? You're in the command module then, right? You're in the command module, and at that time, when you go up to the command module, you don your space suit, and you close your hatch to the airlock, and then you, you restart your re-entry, and at that time, you're fully pressurized, and you require your suit for re-entry due to the heat and whatnot. Okay. How long does it take to get to the moon? How long does it take to get to the moon? Anybody remember? About a week. Oh, about a week? About 43 days. How long was it? A week, wasn't it? A round yeah. trip was about a week, wasn't it? I don't remember yeah. myself. So. They developed metal soon, and I don't know the exact time it took to make, so it's a long period of time to make the, the first suit, the first developmental suit, because you have to experiment with it to find out how it works. Um, and then go back to the drawing board in some cases where you have something wrong with it. That is, those are fingernails. And what do you need the fingernails for? <laughs> for picking things up. That's right, like little dimes, like small rocks, things you couldn't pick up otherwise. Do you have to have those long fingernails? Do you have to have those longer fingernails? I guess it's just a convenient size. Are the space suits heavy? No, how much does suit weigh her? No, this All right, we take it over to the... Okay. First, yeah. What are these? These? This is, a, this is a valve for uh, air intake. 
Oh. You have to have air. You have an air on the pack on your back or connected to a console of some sort. All of it? No, that air. Aperture, there's no air out. You're a good air lock. And an air lock means you lock the air in so that it doesn't escape. Who makes it? Well, let's give it credit. It says right here, Man Orbiting Laboratory, United States Air Force. We give them credit. Yes, sir. Yes, yeah, it's connected to the top here. It's screwed on, and this thing is locked. So we have to have a regular type of uniform. Your car, sit up on the side. The Now People program is designed to show the boys and girls how important it is that they learn their lessons every day in order that they can be the engineers, the businessmen, the teachers of tomorrow. Stan Chambers, Action News, Manhattan Place School. The Now People program is designed to show the boys and girls how important it is that they learn their lessons 